Awesome. Okay, so let's let's get these. Why not? I'm gonna try and keep my bearings and try and work out where I am at all times. But I I I guess we're about a third of the way through this because that's how many opals we have, and we're doing well for bilbies. Like we got nearly half of them, and we got nearly half of the cogs as well. So I guess we're doing all right. Generally speaking, I don't see why not. They um they kind of remind me of the uh, the Kremlins actually from Donkey Kong Country. You know when they die they go oh or something like that. Kind of kind of similar. Not exactly the same, but it's, it's close enough. So yeah, I'm just gonna go around these I think, and then I'm gonna try and make my way back. Because I'm currently as I'm going along I'm basically in my mind trying to keep an eye on where I've been and where I haven't. I'm just trying to keep track of it all. That looks like some kind of mini quest thing. That I'll get to in a second. But yeah, I'm just I'm trying to in my mind keep track of everything and where I've been and where I haven't been. And I feel like I have a general idea on the layout. But I could be wrong and I can't work is that a seahorse in the water there? Is that what that is? Yes. Those frills drive me nuts. They have been tearing around the neighborhood for the last week, causing all sorts of Yeah, they're really annoying. If you can make them stop, I've got a present for you. Oh, I... Okay, it's a deal. Yeah, deal. They're really loud. <laughs> um, so what do you want me to do exactly? That works. Yeah, that does work. I can make them explode. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong though, they are loud. Surprised you're not exploding. What did I do differently to the other two then? I have honestly got no idea what I did differently. But at least I know this is a pretty simple mission, all things considered. Yeah, okay, it's not that. Yeah, what am I missing here? What is it I'm not doing? So I was trying to sort of get them in the the uh, in the motor because it will just cause it to explode. But it seems to be locking on to him. Um, multi rang maybe? That's nah, not it's too it's too far away, I guess. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, is that what I did differently? I attacked him as he was trying to blow up the thing. Is that actually it? Is that the solution the entire time? I mean, it might be. That might be it. God damn it. The one time I'm not over there. God damn it. <laughs> there you go. That's how you do. Bye. Can you hear that? Hear what? That wonderful silence. Nothing. Ah, thanks. <clears throat> Well, uh, I'll be off. Oh, yeah, your reward. Will this do? I don't know what it is, but it sure is pretty. Yeah, it will. You beauty! Yeah!
I should have been, um, do you hear that? Hear what? Exactly. <laughs> should have been that. That would have been a better line. Anyway. Um, oh, where am I now? Okay, so that, um, actually, is that where I came from? Yes, that's where I came from. Okay, cool, cool. We got this. Yes, we got this. Right then. Around here, there will be things. Many things to explore. Oh, man, there's quite a lot around here, it seems. Um, okay, so there's many crabs and stuff. What is this? Whoa! Okay, that launched me quite a lot further than I was expecting. So which one do I want to get in exactly? The back one? Yep. Cool. Okay, so there wasn't actually like any trick to that. It's literally just, oh, just pick one. Pick the right one. So where does this one launch me? Uh, not not the right way, but I mean, technically speaking, it is. I mean, I need to go this way eventually, so. I was probably going to go here first anyway, so yeah, no, that works. I can deal with that. Oh! Chest, here we go. Ahoy there, matey. If you be searching for old Wedgwood's treasure, then an anchor shaped rock will give you pleasure. Right. I see where this is going. I do see what you're doing, game. I like what you're doing. It actually, in a weird way, kind of reminds me of the Rugrats games. I don't know why, uh, <laughs> but it kind of does. So there's that, I guess. Um, I'm going to regret this so much, but I'm going to do it anyway. I really shouldn't deviate like this because I know this is going to take me back to where I was at the beginning. But lo and behold, here we are because I want all the opals and I know I'll lose them otherwise. But at least I know roughly where I'm going. Anchor shaped rock. Gives ye pleasure. Well, we're at the 200 marks. So that's good, right? Sure it is. Right, so that's the beginning. I didn't actually see anything on my way here. Unless I missed something. And again, I was looking for the opals. So let me look on the like the ground. See if I can see something in particular that gives it away, maybe. Oh, hello. You're terrifying. No, I'm not seeing anything. You can actually breathe for a very, very long time, can't you? I feel like... A Tasmanian tiger wouldn't be able to breathe that long. But hey, what do I know? I could be very wrong. At least the game is very kind and actually like gives you a visual to look at, as as well as you know what you have to find. Uh, like, it doesn't just say words like "oh, you find an anchor." Like there technically might be two anchors, you know, like that kind of thing. It's it's quite generous. Which I like. I appreciate. So that's cool. And we've, I, I just generally, I feel like we're doing pretty good. I feel like we're doing well. We're finding all that we need to find at an efficient pace. That's all I really care about right now. Up until the point where I'm missing one or two cocks. <laughs> then I'll be sad. Um, so I still need to go around here. And that will lead me back there. Okay, yes, that is a good idea. So if I go around here, that will lead me back to where the bomb minigame was. Then that will take me back. And there's another thunder egg. Hello. Now, how does one get that? What if I don't destroy this box? No, that won't make a difference. Like, could I use this box to jump on here? All sneaky-like? No, not really. Hmm. I think I need to get up there somehow. I'm sure there'll be something that lets me up there. Eventually. Oh, also, is that the anchor shaped rock? That might be the anchor shaped rock. Which I could go to. Even though I've got other things to do, I could go there. 
Actually, there are opals in the water. So you know what? I will do that. I'll go to the anchor-shaped anchor rock. Um, I'm not seeing a way to get up there. Right, I'm going to go to the anchor-shaped rock because this is... My brain is trying to, like, recall everywhere I've gone and not get lost. Um, and the only way I'm going to do that is if I leave something behind to indicate that I haven't gone there. Because my brain is just slowly but surely picking up where I am. So what I need to do is I just need to find my way back to this island. Um, but I'm glad I did this. This actually worked quite well for me. Now, did I go across to that island? I think I... Oh, wait, that's not an island I can cross to, I don't think. Because there's a barrier line. So actually, we're just going to ignore that for now. So where's the chest for here? There's going to be a chest somewhere. There it is. Hello. Bald Island. Okay, well, I know where that is. That's literally over there. I'm gonna get lost. <laughs> gonna get very, very lost. There it is. Hey, look. Clue number two. And I also see, very sneakily, the uh, the box up there that I don't care about. Army hearties. If clues that rhyme do give you a smile, then coconut shores will surely beguile. Ah, uh, does the map tell me? It does, that's very handy. Good, because I wouldn't have known otherwise. Well, I'll go there next time. Uh, I'm, I'm going to go back to where I was and try and get all the opals and stuff. Because I think I've actually got them all so far. There probably is a place I haven't really visited and I've missed or whatever, but judging from what I have done, I actually think I'm on pace to just do everything, which is lovely. Doesn't change the fact that this level's huge, but it is absolutely lovely. This has gone so well because I'm just trying to do this methodically. He says, as he misses 50,000 things that he doesn't know about. <laughs> I probably am. I'm probably missing loads of stuff. But in my brain, this is going quite well. Now, how do I get up there? I think, is that a cave? That is a cave. Okay. That's exactly why I wanted to go to the other place first. Because I thought that was a cave. And I was like, right, if that's a cave, I want to go there. Well, not, like, first. I want to go and deviate a bit. There's a skull over there. Because, yeah, cave is important. And I'm going to assume this takes me to the toe. Uh, takes me to the top. Because... How else would one get... You know what? This room seems vaguely familiar. Of all the rooms to remember in this game, a game I haven't played in 10 years, this one. Oh my god, that's not good. Um, mm, that did not go well at all. That could have gone worse. Okay, cool, we're good. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this does ring a bell. Again, why? I don't know, but it, it does it does ring bells. How many was it? Was that six? It could have been. I <laughs> Who's to say? I mean <laughs> The game was like, no, you don't find out. Yes. Beautiful. Yeah. Kill all the things. Yes! Take the life as well. Can't hurt, can it? This is pretty cool. Like, that's more like it. Is that everything in here? I mean, apart from, you know, the actual way to go. But I mean, like, in general, like, on the ground level, that looks to be everything. It feels like it is. Just double checking, but I think so. That's cool. Okay, that went well. I'm going to assume lava is instant death. You know, it's, it's lava, so... <laughs> why wouldn't it be? Let's be fair. 
Yeah, I knew that was coming. That's that's why I waited. I was just like, I mean, I could go, or we could be really smart about this and just not die. Cool. Oh, not as cool. No, I I don't know why I remember this room. Like this is really vivid in my mind. Like I just remember all of this. And I really don't know why. Oh, hello. Oh my. Oh no, I was about to go. Suddenly changed my mind. Oh holy moly. That didn't give me mux mux. Didn't give me mux. Didn't give me mux time. I'll just fight him. Um Yes, there was a bridge here. It's gone. That's good to know. I really hope I don't screw this up. This bit's very, very important. To be fair, it's quite difficult to screw up. It gives you a lot of legroom. Whew! Nice! That makes me happy. That makes me very happy. Okay, cool. So. Let's see. So, if we... Go... This way, as we were... This will take us back to where we were a second ago, with the mini game, and then there's a new path up there that we haven't taken. Where's the mini game? The mini game should be just around here, right? No? Yes? Oh wait, no. But then what's that? The mini game's there. Yes, yes, no, no, yes, I'm right, I'm right, okay, I know where I've been. Okay, so yes, this is where I was. Those are the... I was going to say, like, I thought I'd cleared all of this out. I'm pretty sure. Like, the boxes over there should be the way I have to go. And then I died myself for a second. But no, that is it. I'm correct. So these are the boxes I left myself so I wouldn't get lost. Which I technically didn't need because there's a path, like, literally right there with Bilby in it. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, there we go. That's cool. Good. So that's that. I've cleared that, obviously. Um, I will cross here because that's where I think. Yeah, that's where the next message is. Oh, hello. There's a f oh, it's just a life. For a second, I thought it was a thunder egg. I was like, whoa, what? Why? <laughs> just a random thunder egg in the middle of nowhere. No, no. no it's not going to be that easy, Teal. So what is that, four cogs left and one bilby? I think, in fact, I can see the bilby right over there. It's like a little box thing over there that's flashing. I think that's it. Yo ho ho! Deep underwater is where ye must go. To a shipwreck called Janie to see the next show. I know where that is as well. I think that's just over there. It is. There it is. I can see it right now. I was going to say, I, I was wondering what the point of that was, because there wasn't anything hidden in it. There wasn't anything at all. I was like, mm, there's nothing there. So I think the one area I haven't gone is left of the beginning. Like, obviously not counting, like, this stuff. Am I missing something? Oh, there it is. I don't know how I miss. Yeah, yeah, I am missing something. The chest. Okay. And I haven't been anywhere that way, which makes sense. So. Um, okay, cool. So if I do that. Because, yeah, that's why where I was going to go anyway, because I haven't been anywhere that way. So, cool. I'm really, really happy with how this has gone, because everyone was saying this is going to take you ages, you're going to get lost, and by all accounts I probably should have, but I surprisingly really haven't, I've just been smart with how I've travelled this place, so there's probably going to be a lot around here, and I'm sure there's stuff I've missed, I mean there always is, this place is bound to be difficult, but no, this has uh, gone quite well I think pleases me. But yeah, this is a, a place, for sure. Hmm. It's a place with nothing on it right now. <laughs> Surprisingly. There's very little here. 
Yeah, really though, this place is actually really surprisingly barren compared to the rest of this place. Ah, I wonder if that's how I get the uh, the final bilby. I think it might be, you know. But for now, let us get these. We got things to collect. Hello, chest. I see you. I'm assuming that's the last one as well. You did it. You found Wedgwood's treasure. You've searched far and wide, you landlubber ye. Now here be me treasure. So go. Let me be. Ugh. Well, one thing's for certain. Yeah, what's that? Wedgwood was a pirate, not a poet. She had a boat and couldn't row it. Well, look at that. A thunder egg. Who would have guessed? You little ripper! Technically, she didn't give it to you. <laughs> she might still want the treasure. <laughs>